Well, I think the fact that we sell records makes us unique here in Lafayette. You know, you hear a lot of record stores. I mean, we joke about this a lot, but uh, a lot of record stores have records in the name, and they they may have a few, but they shove them off in a corner somewhere, and they, they treat the people who want to buy them like lepers. That's what we're about here: is uh, music available on the you know the highest fidelity and the uh, on the best quality uh, medium. And uh, I think also we're pretty friendly to our customers. Uh, Try to be at least. Uh, <laughs> One thing that's been really neat for us is we've gotten a lot of records that we hadn't, you know, ever heard before. Uh, and I, I didn't know a lot about black metal or uh, industrial music or even bluegrass or certain things of that nature until you know got to hear certain records. And, uh, you know, that that's been pretty cool about it is the the, you know, the eclecticism, the uh, the wide variety that we, we get exposed to. Well, you know, it's not bad. Yeah. Our goal is to have, you know, to eventually basically create a library of music here, um, you know, and we bring in, you know, 100 records every week, um, you know, and sometimes more. Um, we still have thousands of them that we're going through in price. So obviously, you know, selection is something that we have to look to here, but, um, you know, we, we'd like to become involved more in community events, um, you know, and, you know, as much as that is a benefit to our business to be open during those things, we feel that it's really a benefit to the community to have a place where uh, people can go and kind of chit chat and talk about music. <laughs> you know, listen to music. I can see these guys here just talking about music. It's, <laughs> you know, that's kind of the environment that we provide.